What is up, my friends? <clears throat> Excuse me. What is up, my friends? My name is Josh, also known as the Josh Watson, and today we are going to be doing some live question and answer, live Q and A here on stream today with you guys. And I figured I would just. Um, I, I normally I don't stream on Thursdays. In case you guys don't know, I generally have vlogs and other things like that that go up on Thursdays and Sundays. Those are the days I take off. Um, it just kind of I don't know. I just pick those days almost at random, if you will. And uh, but I figured you know today I decided I was going to do something a little bit different and just pop on and do a little bit of a live question and answer with you guys. So uh, let's see here. Um, Exotic, welcome to the stream. Welcome, Let's Play Zombies. Welcome, Tiger Plays. Welcome, uh, Peyton Gibson, Hunter Bailey, Z Down, um, Colin. Welcome, Ryan. Uh, welcome, Just Lemons. Welcome, LSR Snow, um, Lewis, Electric Soda, Smooth One, um, Tylen, Elite Force, Kevin, Cameron. Welcome to all of you. Thank you all very much. And if I missed you, uh, KG the Goat. Uh, welcome to all of you. Thank you all very much for being here. Desktop, Spice, Cold, Red, uh, Divine, Mystery Beasts, uh, Unstoppable Eight, Max Johnson, Zombies Gaming, uh, Tylen Ray. Uh, Rum, I'm not sure how to pronounce your name. Uh, Mr. Clutch, Awesome Sauce. Ryan eyed uh, Joe Wilson as soon as I as soon as I keep thinking that I'm finished welcoming all of you then more people keep coming in but welcome welcome everybody it is awesome to have you all here <clears throat> okay uh, welcome Philip as well okay so uh, let's let's see if we got some questions here um, can you play Xbox one with me on zombies Chronicles I, I definitely will be doing um, I definitely will be doing some open lobbies once we uh, start in there so let's see let me let me scroll back up because I know a lot of you just been saying hello uh, but some people did uh, what state do you live in I live in Oregon I live in Portland Oregon um, Somebody asked, before I even started, um, yeah, so the, the Soothe One has said, Josh, do you know Micah IRL? Yes, I do know Micah in real life. Uh, Micah is actually my wife. Uh, we live in the same house. Okay. Um, what made you start YouTube? That is a very good question. It's one I've addressed before in past Q&As, but I'll give you, uh, um, do you mean 11K special? Yeah, I did. I did put down there, like, it was kind of a 10K special, and, like, obviously, we've already passed 11,000, but, uh, but, I mean, 10K is kind of, is, it's a big number. It's a big deal on YouTube, and so I figured this is kind of a sort of informal, uh, 10,000 question and answer session, session. Um, so let's see. Uh, yeah, what, what made me start YouTube? So, <clears throat> we'll start off with that question first, as our first real question. Uh, basically, there was a number of... Uh, a number of things that made me start YouTube. I have always wanted to, um, like, you know, whenever whenever anybody asks, like, what is your dream job? I don't necessarily I don't necessarily have one dream job. My dream job is more of, uh, um, my my dream job is 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 basically working for myself. That's that's my dream job. I I want to be my own boss. Um, I don't I don't much care what I'm doing. I just want to be my own boss and be able to uh, set my own schedule and uh, and and do the things the way that I want to. So. Um, YouTube is obviously one one way that I can do that. Is there some webcam lag? I'm using I'm using a new a slightly different setup here. Um, if there is a bit of webcam lag, I I do apologize. I can make some adjustments um, if it's annoying. Um, but basically, I I've I've always wanted to be my own boss. I've wanted to have um, you know basically run my own business. And uh, hey, what's up, NR Carp? And um, I I so I decided I I'm trying to organize all my thoughts here. Um, I actually started my first ever YouTube channel in 2010. Um, we posted some prank videos, and a couple of them went actually um, pretty viral. Is it is it bad lag on my webcam? I can I can try to fix it. Not in sync. Okay, g give me one sec, guys. I'll I'll I'll, I'll try to resync it here. Okay. Hopefully that looks hopefully that looks a little bit better. Okay. All right. So um so yes. Um my um. What was I going to say? Now, now I've completely lost my... Oh, yeah, starting YouTube. So I started my first YouTube channel back in 2010, um, and we did some prank videos over there. Uh, we did some just kind of casual um, sketch comedy, things like that. Um, and that was when I really decided that I wanted to have a big YouTube channel. Um, still lag? Okay. Um, I'm not sure what the, uh, what the solution is there. I mean, I could potentially switch to my other webcam, um, but it might, um, it might not fix it. I'm not sure, my friends. Um, I'm, I'm using a new, I'm using a new camera and some new other things like, yeah. Um, is it, is it, um, let me see here. Yeah, YouTube's saying everything's okay. Let me see what I can do here. Um. I mean, I could switch to my other... Yeah, the lag is really bad. I can switch to my other camera, guys. Um, give, me, give me just one sec. Okay. All right, I think we're back. 
I think we are back. And unfortunately, I did switch my other camera. This one is nowhere near as crisp. It's uh, so it doesn't look as nice. Um, but but it, it actually it, it because it's lower quality. Um, it should be able to sync with my webcam much easier. <clears throat> um, so um, so yeah. So it, like I mean, it's, it's not it's not as uh, it's not as high quality uh, the camera, but it works much better with my audio and uh, and it's all synced up and everything like that. So anyway, all right. So uh, let's see. <clears throat> we were, you guys asked me. My first question was. Um, uh, why did I start a YouTube channel? I have always wanted to be my own boss, um, and as such, I've I actually I do own a business outside of YouTube. I own a video production company, and um, and so I I have um, and I've I've always been interested in video production, obviously. And so when YouTube kind of became a thing, and I started learning that there were people making a living on YouTube, I was like, that sounds really awesome. I've always loved entertaining people. I was a stage actor for a long time. I was a film actor for a while, and um, and so I think. That I, I kind of thought that like YouTube is kind of a perfect uh, mesh of all my skills of video production and acting and performing, uh, performing live in front of audiences and things like that. And so, um, so I, I decided I was like, you know what, let's let's give this a try. And so about a year ago, about a year ago, because um, my my channel was started back in July of about 2016, uh, about you know July uh, somewhere back there. Anyway, so um, I I was like, you know what, let's let's give this a shot. Let's give this a shot. And I was like, I'm gonna start creating videos on YouTube. And I start, start, started making pre-recorded videos. Um, that was how I started out. And then after a while, people were like, Josh, you should really start live streaming. Once I started to get a little bit of, uh, um, once I started to get a little bit of traction, people were actually watching my videos. Um, I had maybe 100 or 200 subscribers. And um, <clears throat> and some of my viewers were like, hey, Josh, you should start live streaming because this would be a lot of fun. And so I was like, all right, I guess I'll start live streaming. And so and so I started. So I started live streaming, and um, and it was kind of scary at first um, because it was like this is all live. If I screw up, um, you know, I can't go back and re-record anything. It's like if it just it just happens live um, on on YouTube, and but that really accelerated my growth because um, live streaming generally can can help a gaming channel especially grow faster. So um, so that's that's kind of that that's kind of you know just my my story of uh, of this. So okay. Um, Josh, are you doing a Chronicles giveaway? I already did a Chronicles giveaway, IG Wild Swag, um, and, um, and, uh, just, what was his name? Jacob, I can't remember his name, it was something with a J, Justin or Jacob. Um, I'm doing the Revelations Easter Egg, very cool, Noah. <clears throat> uh, do you want kids, if so, when? Um, not really sure right now, not really sure. Um, what do you do for a living? So yes, um, obviously I teach, um, uh, I teach, I, I live stream on YouTube full time, uh, I, I, I treat YouTube as my full time job. Um, I live stream, you know, six to eight hours a day, and uh, it's very, very awesome. Um, however, I do own a business. Um, I'm, a, I'm an entrepreneur and a business owner outside of YouTube. I own a video production company called Arctic Storm Media, and we create uh, commercials and advertisements for other companies. Uh, we help other companies kind of market themselves on the internet, gain traction, uh, gain customers, things like that. So, is Micah not joining you? Not today. Uh, this is going to be a solo thing. Uh, Jay says, "Are you married?" Yes, I am married to, uh, to Micah. Uh, Micah does have a YouTube channel as well. She actually did a live stream this morning, and it was a ton of fun. A lot of you guys tuned in for that, and uh, and I, I I always hang out in her chats most of the time when when I can. Um, let's see. Question: Why is Twitch streaming so weird? Um, I just started because the only way I can stream on Xbox. Um, Twitch streaming is it's just a little different. Um, it's a little different. Uh, 68 hours a day is impossible. No, I said six to eight. Between like six. Seven or eight, somewhere in there. I, I, usually, I, I'll, I'll live stream from somewhere between six to eight, to eight hours, not sixty-eight. <laughs> um, Desktop says, "I love your streams. Thank you very much." When are you doing an open lobby on Black Ops Three? Um, obviously, Zombie Chronicles is on Black Ops Three, and so I will be doing live streams of Zombie Chronicles once it comes out on stream. And so um, that's that's probably going to be when my next open lobbies on there are going to be. Uh, in the meantime, between now and then, I am focusing on playing the older games. Uh, that have the Zombie Chronicles maps. I'm, I mean, who knows? I might do a little bit of Black Ops 3 between now and then, but we're kind of coming down to the wire. There's only a few days left between now and when Zombie Chronicles does launch. Um, and once Zombie Chronicles does launch, I am going to be streaming that pretty much exclusively, uh, at least for a couple of weeks. Keeper Going says, how are you? I'm doing very well. Who is Micah? Micah is my wife. Um, she is awesome. You'll see her in my chats pretty often. Uh, we, we've been together for like six years. Um... And uh, it's awesome. Yeah, I mean, we we started dating. Yeah, about six years. Yeah, about six years ago. Uh, dated for a long time, and uh, we're at the point where we're taking our relationship super, super seriously. We'd been together for a very long time, and and you know, rather than just moving in together, we were like, you know what? We know we want to do this for the rest of our lives. We know we want to be together for the rest of our lives. So let's just seal the deal. And so we did. So we, we got we got married pretty young. Um, moderators, uh, can somebody put the Micah chat or Micah command in the chat so that'll it'll uh, put a link to her chat. 
Um, who is your favorite YouTuber? Uh, my favorite YouTuber um, generally is Ali A. Um, just just of all YouTubers, I, I'm a huge fan of Ali A. I've been a, been a viewer of his to uh, for for years for a very long time, and um, and I love his content. Uh, he kind of you know. Uh, kind of got caught up in Pokemon Go for a while rather than doing Call of Duty once Infinite Warfare dropped, but who can blame him? Infinite Warfare kind of sucks. And so, um, but now now that, I mean, he's kind of getting back into into Call of Duty and it's, uh, and he's, he's an awesome guy. And I've always, I've, I've loved, I, like I watch both of his channels and I love all of his content. Um, as far as zombies uh, people, obviously Ali A did a lot with zombies back in Black Ops 2, not so much with Black Ops 3. I really hope he will, um, I, I hope that he will, uh, uh, start doing some zombie chronicles and stuff, um, but uh, but we'll see. Anyway, as far as zombies YouTubers go, uh, Mr. Dalek JD is my favorite zombies YouTuber for sure. And yes, X X K P C has asked me a couple of times, uh, did you donate uh, ten dollars to Mr. Dalek JD? Yes. Over the last two days, I've I've made a number of donations to him on stream. He's a very awesome dude. Um, and so I, I figured I was like, you know what? I've been watching him for years. I want to start contributing and uh, and hopefully you know ho hopefully also build potentially a little bit of a, a rapport with him as well. Because uh, he's he's a very awesome guy. Um, hey, what's up, Detective Pack? Um, Ag, who, who who is your favorite vlogger? Um, I don't watch a ton of just like full time vloggers. Um, obviously, there are a lot of YouTubers who are just you know daily vloggers. Like that's what they do. Um, I do enjoy Syndicate's vlogs on occasion. Um, he's a little too uh, intense for me at times. If that makes any sense. If you guys watch Syndicate, I think you'll know exactly what I mean. He's a very intense individual, um, and so. Uh, but but he is also very very entertaining. So and I, I did watch a lot of his zombie stuff uh, when he was more of a zombies YouTuber than he is now. Uh, still a very cool guy. Um, so I'd say you know he's one of my favorite vloggers. I do really enjoy Ali A's vlogs. I also watch uh, Ali's girlfriend Ali uh, um, uh, Claire. Um, I watch her channel a lot and I love her vlogs as well. Question: Will you dab? <laughs> Not right now. <laughs> um, Star Army. Uh, Notice me sent by how many of my girlfriends do you remember it's chris oh i don't i don't know man <laughs> um is it stressful to live stream yes a lot a couple of you have asked that um is it is it stressful to live stream um yes and no and probably for different reasons than you think um personally myself um somebody also asked like what was it like to be a stage actor so i'll kind of tie that into this um i like i said i was a stage actor uh for like seven years i started doing stage acting uh when i was 11 years old and i did it until i was like 17 or 18 um, and then when I went to university, I got into, um, I got into film acting and started acting in short films, um, and things like that. And so, um, <clears throat> but, um, but I, I kind of prefer stage acting because I love the energy, um, you know, that when you walk out onto that stage, you're, you're in front of, you know, hundreds of people and, um, and just the energy of that is intoxicating. Um, I, I love live performances. And so, um, I think that's part of the reason why I enjoy live streaming so much is the fact that it is live, and so there's there is a little bit of that stress to it, but it's it's a certain kind of energy um, that, like I said, is kind of intoxicating and um, and is very very cool and very very fun um, because of the fact that um, you can get that kind of live feedback from people. Star Army, thank you very much for subscribing. Um, you kind of get that live feedback from people and also just the idea what's what's more stressful to me rather than like oh my gosh it's you know like I'm, like 200 people are watching me live or whatever the other day I had like 350 people watching me live and um, and that is not like that's not stressful to me what is stressful is when I have you know it's like oh yesterday I had 200 people watching me now I only have like 50 that's that's what's stressful to me on live streaming when when I'm like whatever I'm doing is not working you know um, that's that's the part of live streaming that can stress me out is when I feel like I'm failing at it. Um, that's that's the part of live streaming that is is can be stressful to me. When when you have a stream that's not as hype as some of your previous streams, then that 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 part of it can be stressful. Um, do you still have your business out of Utah? Yes, uh, Pathfinder, I do. Um, I'm still a, uh, still a partner in that business. Um, I still I'm still on, on phone calls very often with my partner, um, my business partner uh, who still lives in Utah. Uh, he lives in Salt Lake City, and so he's kind of uh, taking kind of the main. Uh, front of that. I'm also, um, you know, kind of trying to expand our business a little bit into Portland. Um, I've been meeting with some clients here, trying to set up a couple things. We've got some prospects up here. And, uh, and so we're kind of, kind of hoping to set up two bases of operation for Arctic Storm Media and kind of expand it into Portland as well. Um, so, but yeah, I am still a partner in that company and I am still very involved, even though I have kind of taking a little bit of a backseat um, in, in the company. So, <clears throat> uh, RC Cola, welcome to the stream. Uh, welcome, Basil. Welcome, Jacob. Um, Welcome, God of Cod. Um, yes, I do remember you, my friend. Uh, welcome, Jeremy. Welcome, Parker. Uh, welcome, Ben Jr. 
um, and Kenny and um, Angelina and Dylan. Um, do you ever do you play better on stream or off stream? Um, it kind of depends. Um, I used to play much better off stream because I didn't have to think about commentating, but I've gotten to a point where I've been doing it for so long that it, I don't really think about it anymore and it doesn't bother me. Um, like having to commentate and talk over my stuff, over my gameplay and reading the chat while I'm streaming, um, it, like while I'm playing, uh, doesn't, uh, doesn't, uh, doesn't affect me. Um, Junior says, I live in Salt Lake City. What is this company about? <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, so the company that I own, my voice is still a little bit broken, guys. Uh, the company that I own, the company that I own is called Arctic Storm Media. Um, and it is a video production company. We make commercials. So, um, how do you make your channel art? Um, I made my channel art in Photoshop. Um, along with the fact that I am a video producer and video editor, I've been using Photoshop for like 13 years at this point. Um, and so I, uh, I've, I've, got, I've gotten really, really good at graphic design and things like that. So I do all of my own, pretty much all of my design is that you see on my channel, uh, all of my thumbnails, uh, my overlays, uh, everything, my channel art so far has been done by myself. The, the, the one exception to that is my logo uh, right below my face right there. Uh, that, la that logo I actually had done by a professional designer. And I am getting to the point where um, I, I'm wanting things that are a little bit higher quality design than I have the skill to do. So I actually am working with another designer right now to get some new channel art, um, to get a new overlay, those sorts of things. So my channel is growing to the point where I feel like it's about time to update. Um, uh, Josh, when you get big, will you remember me? RC Cola, I tell this to everybody. Um, if you're if you're staying active on the channel, especially if you stay active on on my social media accounts, there's really no reason I'll ever forget you. So uh, so make sure that that's uh, make sure, you know if you want me to remember you, just be active in the streams and be active on social media. And absolutely, I will always remember you guys. Uh, Joe Wilson says my favorite TV show right now. I have been watching the show The Hundred. Um, it's a fantastic show. I actually uh, I actually know uh, one of the actors in that personally, um, Henry Ian Cusick. Um, he I, I worked on a movie with him a while ago. I was the assistant director on that. Um, and he, he was in Lost. Um, he's an awesome, awesome guy. And, uh, and so I decided, I, was, I, I saw the show and I was like, oh, like Ian's in this, because he goes by Ian. Um, and I was like, I should, I should watch that. And so I started watching it. It was like, oh my gosh, this show is amazing. So it's a, it's a fantastic show. Um, question, how are you guys so good at zombies? Uh, Justice, <laughs> I am, uh, um, I've been playing it for a long time. I uh, just play it for a very long time. Um, Ethan says lying. Lying about uh, knowing Henry and Cusick. Uh, yeah, Desmond. Yeah, he plays Desmond Hume um, on on uh, Lost. Dylan, you're correct. You can look at my IMDb. Um, my credits are on the film with him. Who was your first subscriber? My first subscriber uh, was a guy by the name of Intrinsic Twenty Eight, I believe, um, who's actually a friend of mine in real life. Um, and so, yes, Prison Break. Prison Break is also a fantastic show. Prison Break is also a fantastic show. But um, yeah, he's a friend of mine in real life. Um, I started my YouTube channel. Um, and I was, I've been talking to him about it a lot. And so I sent him the link and was like, I did it. I started my YouTube channel and he's like, well, here's your first sub. And I have no idea who my second one was. Maybe that would be a more meaningful, um, his name is what? Henry Ian Cusick is his name. Um, Furious Eagle, shout out to you, my friend. Thank you very much for being here. Um, I feel like you're salty about the zombies YouTuber coming to my stream. No, uh, not at all, Parker. I, I mean, you know, I'm, I'm happy for you. Uh, I think that's very, very cool. And I, I've, I, I, um, I don't easily get jealous, um, and I especially, it's, it, might, it might seem kind of silly, but um, the more, more so I don't get covetous, to use a kind of biblical term, which is like being like upset that somebody else got something instead of you. Um, I definitely, I, I don't know, I'm just not, not into that sort of thing. Uh, Corndog says, how old are you? Uh, welcome, Corndog. I am uh, 24 years old. Uh, let's see, there was another question that I was going to ask <clears throat> or going to answer there. Um, oh, my dream job. Yeah, I've already talked about that a little bit. Um, YouTube is kind of one of my dream jobs for sure. Uh, there's a lot of things in life that I could do and be happy. Uh, the main the main thing is that uh, I want to uh, own my own business. I want to be my own boss. So uh, do you watch The Flash Last Arrow? Yes, um, I have not. Uh, I have not watched them as much recently, but I have watched The Flash a lot. So um, let's see. How's everything going? Detective Pack It's going very, very well. Uh, say my name. I'm in a lot of your streams. Uh, Minecraft Prison Crafter. Yes, you are indeed in a lot of my streams. Uh, bye, Josh. See you in the next stream. All right, we'll see you later, RC Cola. Do you have any siblings? Yes, I do have some siblings. Um, I have uh, four sisters and one brother. I came from a very big family, so uh, so yeah, I, I do have I do have a lot of siblings. Uh, Furious Eagle says you're awesome. Thank you very much. What's nine plus ten? That would be nineteen. <laughs> um, I could not keep my cool. LOL. Yeah, Parker. Yeah, that was that was pretty. That was pretty intense. Um, do you like the Do you like Vanoss Gaming? Yep, he's a pretty cool guy. I'm just scrolling up to grab some of the questions that I missed. 
Uh, what do you think of the new Zombie Chronicles trailer? Yes, I did watch that today, and it is absolutely fantastic. Uh, Kenny says, why haven't you added me on PlayStation 4? I haven't been on PlayStation 4 in a while, and so I know I think I've got like 150 pending friend requests over there. Uh, it's a little bit insane. Uh, Zombie115, um, if you'd like me to check out your channel, my friend, make sure to send it to me over on Twitter. <clears throat> okay. Um, so go ahead and play DLC 5 in chronological order, or what? I'm not sure. I'm not sure what like how I'm going to start off with DLC 5. I'm not sure that if I'm, if I'm going to just play it in chronological order, if I'm going to play it through like my favorites first. I feel like if I just pick my favorites first, then the maps that I don't like as much will kind of just fall by the wayside and then I'll just never end up playing them. Um, so, you know, I think I think maybe chronological order might make a lot of sense, but I feel like a lot of other people are going to be doing that. And so I may actually start with some of the less popular maps first, uh, simply to stand out a little bit. Because if I just go for the really popular maps... Or if I go for a chronological order, I'm going to be doing the same thing as everybody else. And so I may actually go with some of the some less popular maps. Uh, less less popular maps. Okay, um, I'm 24 years old, Furious Eagle. Um, can you do react videos? Yes, guys, I actually do want to start doing some react videos. I want to start doing more vlogs. I want to start doing more IRL challenge videos. I want to start doing react videos. I just like casual videos um, where I can just interact with you guys. Uh, somebody also a while ago mentioned my webcam. I do have a higher quality webcam, but it didn't want to sync with my audio today. Um, that's the problem I've always had with that webcam is it doesn't like to sync with my audio. Um, and this webcam, for whatever reason, does. I don't know what the issue. The, the, my, my, other web, my other webcam is a Logitech C920, uh, which is kind of like the best webcam in the industry. It's what literally every live streamer uses. But for whatever reason, I can't get it to work. I think it's my computer, the fact that I'm on a Mac. Uh, Logitech is really designed to work with PC. So once again, I'm uh, shortchanged by being a, an Apple user uh, in the gaming community. <clears throat> Am I ever going to win a giveaway? Um, I don't know, my friend. I can't help you with that one. Uh, you should play, <clears throat> excuse me. You should play World at War first, uh, then Black Ops One, then Origins. Yeah, I, again, I might do might do uh, chronological order. Uh, did you like Legos as a child? Yes, absolutely, guys. I was a huge Lego fan. Um, I still, to this day, I own a 55 gallon tote, like one of those big, giant Rubbermaid containers that like your grandma has in her storage uh, garage or whatever, with like a bunch of random crap in it. I have one of those, like a giant, giant container full of Lego, and I have so much Lego that it actually doesn't even fit in there. I have several other boxes as well, just filled with Lego. Uh, so maybe one day, it might be kind of weird, but maybe one day we'll do like a Lego live stream or something like that. Favorite color? I don't really have a favorite color. Um, I don't really have a favorite much of anything. I'm just, I like a lot of things, and so I do have a favorite food, and that is pizza. But at the same time, like, I love burgers. Like, people ask me all the time, what's my favorite zombies map? And I've just started saying Origins because it's simple. Um, but the fact is that I don't necessarily have like one favorite zombies map. Um, I, I like all of them a lot. Uh, there's very few zombie maps that I don't like. So anyway, um, and that's kind of just the way I am with everything. Favorite movie. Again, I just kind of picked one of my favorites and I just say that I say, I tell people my favorite movie is the, the return of the King movie, the third Lord of the Rings film, uh, because it is definitely one of my favorites. And so, um, but I just in general, um, I don't, I don't know that I have like favorites, like a favorite of anything because, um, you know, I feel like I'm a little more well-rounded than that, if that makes any sense. <clears throat> anyway, um, do you have any pets? Uh, right now, Micah and I do not own any pets. However, uh, Micah's mom's cat is with is lives in our house uh, with us right now, um, and so uh, we're so we kind of sort of have a cat, uh, but it's not actually ours. Favorite type of shoe? Um, I'm pretty. I don't know. I like I like lots of shoes. Um, I like uh, stylish shoes. Um, I've got I don't know. I've got lots of different types of shoes. I have uh, uh, Kelly. Thank you very much for subscribing. I've got uh, like a couple of pairs of loafers. I've got uh, like some really nice uh, All Stars and uh, some Nikes. And I've got um, I, I'm you know I, I I like a lot of different types of shoes. So um, did you like the Hobbit movies? I did like the Hobbit movies pretty well. They were not as they were not as robust as as the Lord of the Rings films. Um, but I also followed the production of that very closely. And so I can actually if you wanted to get into the why the Hobbit movies are different. Uh, and not as good as the Lord of the Rings films. I could actually pick them apart, and I can tell you exactly why uh, they're not as good. Um, and it's basically, actually, the studio screwed it up. It was nothing to do with Peter Jackson or anything like that. So, anyway. <clears throat> um, let's see. Sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm still a little bit sick, guys. I'm going to try to get rid of this uh, sore throat before tomorrow. Um, so, um, I'm not racist, but what culture are you? Um, hey, what's up, Kiara? Welcome to the stream. How, how would that be racist? What culture am I? I mean, I'm, I'm white. I live in the United States. I'm actually half Canadian. Um, but I'm an American citizen. I don't have Canadian citizenship, uh, even though I could get it very easily if I wanted to. 
Um, eat a banana. No, I'm not going to eat a banana. Do you know Spanish or any other language? I do speak French. Um, I'm, I've lost a lot of my ability to speak French because I don't speak it very often, so I don't speak it very well uh, anymore. But um, uh, but I don't speak Spanish, but I do speak a little bit of French. Do you have a girlfriend slash wife? Yes, um, I have a girlfriend who I married, uh, who is now my wife. So that's I don't know. I don't know. I I, I say that I, I always for whatever reason I like to come up with weird ways to say. The fact that Mike and I are married, I don't know. Are you excited for World War II zombies? Yes, I'm very excited for it. Uh, what is your favorite food? Um, uh, pizza. Yeah, I do have. I do actually have a favorite food, but it, even then, it's like. But I do like burgers a lot as well, um, and and I do like. Uh, I do like uh, uh, burritos, like uh, uh, Mexican food. Uh, what's your favorite Halo game? I haven't played a ton of the Halo games, honestly. Um, I don't know. The I I don't I don't know. That. I think the only one that I own. Is Halo Reach, and I did enjoy that one, so I guess I suppose that's that might be my favorite. Uh, but yeah, somebody also asked, was I am I more excited for World War II zombies or DLC Five? I'd say at this exact moment, I'm more excited for DLC Five because we know more about it and the hype has been built up, and I'm very excited for it. It's literally just a few days away. World War II zombies, like I'm very excited for it, and I think it's gonna be awesome. But I don't know as much about it as I do for DLC Five. So right now, in this moment, I'm definitely more excited for DLC Five. Ask me, you know, two months from now, and it's like, oh yeah, DLC Five was super cool. But now I'm excited for World War Two Zombies, obviously, because that's that would that's be how that that would be how. The, and, and you get the idea. Um, I like the the show the the Hundred on Netflix. Yeah, uh, the Hundred is a very good show. Um, how do you have such a good jawline? <laughs> it's funny, my jawline actually doesn't look that great today because I really need to shave. Um, so, <laughs> um, but uh, but yeah, my. Um, I like my neck down here. I really need to shave. Uh, it's looking very scruffy, and then my beard is getting a little bit long as well. So, uh, definitely, definitely do need to shave. Um, would you marry me, man? Boog? Nope. I don't. First of all, don't swing that way. Secondly, I'm already married. Uh, what state do you live in? I live in Oregon. Have you watched Thirteen Reasons Why? I have not so far. Um, uh, I, and I, I might, I might at some point. I, I'm not sure that it would be a show that I would enjoy, but I don't know. I'm not really sure. Um, what do you like on your pizza? I like I'm a meat lovers kind of guy. I I'm all about you know Italian sausage, pepperoni, bacon, uh, all of that. Just you know more more meat. To the more meat toppings, the better in my opinion. Um, Cune, can we create a zombie team? Um, I'm not sure. Do you mean what do you mean by zombie team? Um, I definitely want to create a community uh, on Xbox Live and PlayStation Four where you guys can start uh, connecting with me on uh, on Xbox Live and, and PlayStation a little bit more easily, and then. Um, you can also connect with each other on there as well pretty easily. <clears throat> Do I have water? I should get water. Um, let's see. How have you grown? How, how did you grow that beard? Matt Vanilla, welcome to the stream, my friend. Uh, it's pretty, pretty simple, actually. I just, uh, stopped shaving. Um, so, uh, give me one sec here. I'm gonna ask Micah to bring me some water real quick. I bug you every stream now, you're good, corn dog. Uh, when is that Discord coming? Yes, actually, really, honestly, if I, if there's little things like that, just keep bugging me about it. It'll happen eventually. Um, are you streaming later, JK? No, yeah, this is this is my this, this is gonna be my only stream for today. Uh, where do you live? I live in Portland, Oregon. Um, like an Xbox club, or yeah, yeah, like an yeah. So I'll make it like an Xbox Live uh, community and a PlayStation uh, like a PSN community that you guys can join. So, um, did you see my 10k subs gift to you, or did you not? No, lemons, I did not. Um, would you undo your man bun for two dollars? Uh, probably not. I did actually think I did I did mildly consider having a donation goal on this stream of like. I don't know, 50 bucks or something, and uh, have and saying that if we reached that, then Micah would come in and braid my hair on stream. Because uh, if you guys don't know, I do have I have a man bun back there. My hair is actually really really long. Uh, it comes down to like I don't know, you know like like past my chest, um, and it's, I have very very long hair. Um, and so I think I think maybe um, maybe for a special video or something like that, maybe Micah will put braids in my hair or something weird like that just for funsies. <clears throat> Let's see. Is X or is, is DLC five going to be on PC? It will be on PC, but it's going to come out to. It's going to come to PlayStation four first for the first thirty days. Then it'll come out on Xbox and PC after that. So sometime in June, uh, middle of June, you know, June fourteenth to sixteenth, somewhere around there. Uh, do you watch football? Um, I don't watch football uh, either, like American football or uh, European football slash soccer. Um, I don't. Uh, yeah, I don't. Uh, I'm I'm not a big sports person, unfortunately. Um, and so I haven't followed either of those. Uh, why do you have long hair? Yes. Uh, so backpack. Welcome to the stream, by the way. Uh, been a while, my friend. Good to see you back. Uh, why do I have long hair? Um, there's a number of reasons, um, and I could get into some of the more deep personal reasons, but I think we'll kind of just go with more of the uh, simple reasons of the fact that I I've always enjoyed 
uh, being unique. I've always enjoyed being different than other people around me. I don't want to be somebody who just blends in with the crowd. Um, it's also kind of goes into why I started my YouTube channel, um, that I've always really, really enjoyed standing out from the crowd and being unique and being somebody uh, that, you know, makes... Uh, makes a difference in a way, I suppose, or and and is just I, I don't want to just be another person. I want to be somebody unique and individual and special. And uh, and so and long hair was kind of one of those ways that I could express myself in that way that I could, um, you know, that I grew my I decided to grow my hair out for that reason. I've I've always wanted to have long hair as well, uh, especially when I was a teenager. Um, I wanted I wanted long hair back then, and my parents were uh, my parents are very traditional, um, and uh, and uh, and so my dad especially was like no long hair. Um, and so then once I was out of the house and I uh, was no longer in the military, then I was like, I'm just letting my hair grow. And uh, I've been growing it for four years now. I've, I've, somebody asked earlier um, how, how, uh, how long I've been growing my hair. I've been growing my hair for four years now. Um, and, and it's about 25 inches. I measured it a little while ago. Um, used to have long hair, but I cut it short. Yeah, I've heard that from a number of people. Um, what is your background? My background is just my, my bedroom behind me. Um, it's pretty simple. I've got, a, I've got a Josh Watson poster there. I've got a Kylo Ren poster behind me, which if I duck down, you can kind of see. You can kind of see that back there. And then I've got my big screen TV. Uh, one, of my, one of my big screen TVs, I have three of them. But um, I have one back right there, uh, one out in the living room, and another one down in the basement. Anyway, um, uh, how long is the stream going to be? We're going to go for probably about another 30 minutes. We've been going for 30 minutes, and uh, I'll probably go for about another 30. Um, do you know who PewDiePie is? Yes, of course, I do know who PewDiePie is. He's, uh, he's an awesome guy. How many Perkaholics do you have? I actually do not have that many Perkaholics right now. I'm running very low. I'm going to have to stock up um, on them for DLC 5. Um, will you and Skizzle Axe do a high round attempt on Buried Black Ops 2? Uh, P.S. I would like that. Potentially. Um, pr probably not. Uh, Skizzle and I have very uh, kind of different streaming schedules and very different communities. Um, and so there is some overlap between our communities, but we kind of have a little bit of different subsets of the uh, Zombies community. And so I'm not sure that it, uh, I'm not sure that it, I'm not going to, no, I'm not going to answer it. Uh, sorry guys, uh, call from a uh, random phone call from Colorado. I was like, I'm, no, I'm not gonna answer that. Okay, um, Josh, you're the best. Keep it up. Thank you very much. Italian, I'm Italian guy. Uh, do you play PC? If so, what games? I do play PC occasionally. How long is your hair? Uh, yeah, motionless. Uh, my hair um, is is about 25 inches. It's a little over two feet. My hair is very very long. Uh, make a cool room background uh, like black tiles. Yeah, guys, I actually do want to. When we move out of this house, um, when Micah and I move out of this house, uh, we're hoping to buy our own house. Um, and we are going to get, um, we're actually, it sounds a little crazy, but we're, we're planning to get a four bedroom house. Um, and the, the four bedrooms are going to be as follows, basically, uh, like the master bedroom where our bed will be uh, a guest room, uh, so we can have friends and family over. Um, and then an office for myself and an office for Micah is actually what we're planning to do. And so when, when that happens, I'll have my own streaming room where I will, uh, set up like an awesome background. Um, and I'll, I'm going to get like a couch and a bunch of really cool like action figures and uh, YouTube things and Call of Duty things and video game things and it's going to be really really cool. Uh, but it's going to it's a ways out. It's a ways out, unfortunately, um, because uh, you know we're we're still saving for a house uh, for a down payment on a house and all that stuff. So hey, what's up, Ryan? Welcome to the stream. Um, let's see, uh, what school did you go to? I I studied I, I attended university slash college at uh, BYU uh, Br Brigham Young University in Utah. Uh, do you only stream on YouTube? Uh, Declan, welcome to the stream, my friend. Uh, for now, I do only stream on YouTube. I do have a Twitch account. I have considered streaming over there, um, but I have not as of yet streamed on, on Twitch, but I might do so in the near future. Um, can you do a backflip? Uh, believe it or not, I actually can. I was a, I was a gymnast uh, when I was a teenager. I haven't done one in a long time, um, but I actually did do a back handspring pretty recently, and I was like, I feel like I could do a backflip right now, but uh, but I didn't. So <laughs> um, maybe 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 pretty soon I'll maybe I'll make a little video of that or something. I'd have to go to a gym to do it. Uh, uh, anyway, um, um, XZX935, welcome to stream. Yes, I do remember you. Um, do you know how to do this back uh, backpack? I do not know how to do that little logo. That's pretty cool. Um, Arrow, I know it's sad. Arrow fan right here. Oh, I <laughs> I must admit, uh, yeah, you guys are having a conversation. Very cool. Um, let's see. Love to see you. Yeah, yep, yep, yeah. Skizzle is a, yeah, Skizzle Axe is a very cool guy, but um and, and we've talked about doing uh we've talked about doing some stuff together, but I'm I'm not sure it's gonna happen. Uh in, at least at least right now. What map are you playing first on Zombie Chronicles? I'm not sure. I I'm not sure what, what map I'm gonna play first. Um I've considered a couple of different ones, um, but um but I haven't made a final decision yet. If I donate a hundred dollars, what will you do? Um, I'll take my hair down. A lot of you guys have asked to see my hair down. And a lot of you have never seen my hair down. 
Uh, although if you want to see my hair down, you can go to my Instagram. Uh, my Instagram link is at the bottom of the description. I have pictures of my hair down. Uh, but I'll take my hair down on, on stream if you really want. Um, yes, I did see Ralph, uh, Ralph for 935 last night. Um, <coughs> sorry, guys. Um, I did see Ralph on stream last night. I was part of that stream. Um, and he actually shouted me out. He, he knew who I was. I, I, I'd never seen him before, but apparently he's seen my streams and, um, and was excited that I was there. Obviously I was definitely one of the very, very smaller YouTubers that were part of that thing, but it was very cool to, to see the community come together like that. And, to and I actually, uh, mentioned it to Dalek today on his stream. Um, and, and he was like, well, yeah, cause I asked him, was it planned? Um, um, that, that was what I wanted to know was, uh, was whether or not that was planned. And uh, he said it was not actually planned, that he had just popped into this guy's stream. His reaction was crazy, so he started calling up the other YouTubers, and they all kind of got together and did this crazy thing. So, um, Parisa says, holy crap, last time I watched you had 5,000. Yes, indeed, my friends. I got over 5,000 subscribers in one week. Uh, absolutely, absolutely crazy. It was very, very cool. Have you played Roblox? I've actually never played Roblox, uh, believe it or not. I've played quite a bit of Minecraft, uh, but I've actually never played Roblox, which is uh, kind of kind of interesting, because I feel like they do kind of go hand in hand. Um to some extent, to some extent. Charlie Clark, uh, when will I ever get into a game with you? Charlie, I, all of my open lobbies are first come, first serve, as a lot of you guys know. <coughs> Excuse me. How much money for you to cut your hair? I have no idea. Um, it have to be a lot. have to be a lot. <laughs> you should play Call of Duty since you can gain a lot of subscribers from it. Uh, yes, I do play Call of Duty. Uh, that's my full-time job right now is actually playing Call of Duty on YouTube. So thank you very much for the tip. Um, the ultimate perk... Yes, I see that you changed your name, my friend. Thank you very much, Micah. My throat is dying, my friends, and so uh, getting some water to help it help it uh, not die. Okay, um, Origins are buried. <clears throat> of those two, I'd probably say I prefer Origins a little bit. Buried is very, very awesome as well. Favorite zombies map and why? Declan. Um... Oh, play it right now. Uh, well, Sham, yeah, I'm, I'm not going to play Call of Duty right now. This is just a Q&A stream. Um, uh, favorite, call, yeah, favorite Zombies map and why? Um, my favorite Zombies map is Origins. Um, and why is because I think there's a lot of cool things to do on it. The Easter egg is a lot of fun. Um, and uh, second, I don't know, second favorite map is probably Dryzendraka for a lot of the same reasons. I like the Easter egg a lot. There's a lot to do on the map, and, uh, and it's a lot of fun. So, um, Have you ever played Nebulous? I have not. Uh, favorite staff? Um... I don't know, uh, probably a kind of toss up between, I was going to say wind and fire, but I actually start, I'm starting to like ice staff quite a bit as well now. So I don't know, pretty all of them. I like all of them. Um, okay. Sounds, sounds good. Lemons. I appreciate it. Were you honest in school for the most part? Yeah. I mean, there was, especially when I was younger, there was, you know, the tendency, the, the temptation and the tendency to try to, um, you know, cut corners on my homework and things like that. But, um, uh, but at university, I did take my education fairly seriously, and so, um, so yeah. Um, are you feeling better? I'm mostly feeling better. As you can kind of hear, my voice is still a little bit uh, broken, and so I'm trying very hard to uh, to keep my throat, uh, you know, well maintained. I suppose if that makes any sense. Uh, anyway, uh, who's your? Uh, you're my favorite zombies YouTuber. Well, thank you very much, Justin. I appreciate it. Uh, does James support your live streams? Uh, James, my business partner. Uh, yes, James is very, uh, very supportive. Uh, James is my business partner who owns uh, half of the company that I'm one of the co-founders of. Um, and yeah, he actually, he actually called me the other day just to talk about my YouTube channel. And was like, dude, your YouTube channel has been growing up like blowing up like crazy, um, and and just wanted to kind of congratulate me on that. Uh, do you know any words in Spanish? If you do, can you say them? I mean, like the basic like hola, hola, cómo estás? Like that's about it though. Um, Josh, how did you get into YouTube? Uh, who got you into YouTube? If anybody, um, so any, yeah, um, I, I've, I've been a big fan of Ali A for a long time and watching his, um, content and stuff really inspired me to create YouTube, uh, excuse me, to start creating YouTube videos. So let's see. Um, excuse me. Origins or Dry Um, I'm going to, I'm going to make, I'm going to. I'm actually going to say Origins Remastered. Even though I haven't played it, I'm guessing that Origins Remastered um, is definitely going to like 100% be my favorite map. But I don't know. I don't know. Maybe maybe out of the remastered maps, maybe I'll be uh, a little bit, you know, a favorite map will be different. I can't, you, blah, blah, blah. Maybe my favorite map will be different once the actual remastered maps come out. Uh, hopefully you hit 100K. The plaque would look nice in your background. Yes, it would. It would look very, yeah, little little uh, 100K plaque right there would look very cool. How old are you? I'm 24 years old. Um... Highest round solo on Buried, uh, somewhere in the 60s on stream. I've done, I've been to round 50. We definitely could have kept going, uh, but I, I decided to, to end it there. Uh, gotta go catch you later. All right, sounds good. Blank perception. See you, see you later, my friend. Uh, Fireblade, yes, I do remember you. 
Um, I love that it won't let me donate to you. Oh, I'm sorry, not Dawson. I'm sorry about that. Give me one sec to take another drink of my water here, guys. Um, can you say the letter M without touching your lips? Probably not. That sounds kind of difficult. Uh, what's your 2018 sub goal? Um, I do have uh, some some goals. I'm not sure if I'm ready to share them publicly yet, uh, but I do have uh, I do have some goals set for myself as far as uh, you know views and subscribers, um, kind of incrementally throughout the year, um, and and I have kind of a range. Uh, basically, the further away it gets, the bigger my range is, um, because um, you know it's like I mean you know right now kind of my goals are like you know I want to hit you know I definitely fifteen thousand. Uh, by uh, the end of next week. I want to get another 5,000, uh, another 4,000 between now and the end of next week. I think that's absolutely very, very doable. Uh, we got 5,000, actually almost 6,000 in the last week from like now until a week ago. Um, and uh, and from, from now until uh, the f like a Saturday after, so not like this coming Saturday, but the Saturday after this one. Uh, so like a week and two days, I definitely want to have like 15,000 subscribers at least. Um, and I think that's extremely, extremely doable. Um, but, um, and then I kind of, as, as my goals go further and further away, um, they kind of become more broad as to like, you know, but, but yeah, anyway, anyway, um, uh, will you do trolling videos? Potentially. I've, I've thought about doing some trolling videos. I'm not much of a troll myself. I don't necessarily want to really encourage trolling in the community, so I'm not sure that I will do those. Um, what is your real name? My real name is Josh. Uh, Josh Josh Watson. Uh, what do you work for? I work for myself, actually. Yeah, I've addressed that a couple of times. I'm self-employed, and uh, and I, I own my own company. Um, uh, B Biddle, Biddle Bob donated $3. Welcome back, Bob. He says, I'm back with a heart emoji. Thank you very much, my friend. I'll, I'll give you a little heart emoji back. That was the... I felt like that was the creepiest heart emoji that has ever happened on my part. But thank you, thank you very much. And as you guys can see, I actually do have a new donation gift. I have a new new uh, Chris Pratt donation gift. Uh, that's that's brand new as of today. Uh, so that's kind of fun there. Uh, let's get some let's get some heart emojis in the chat from my boy Bob as well. Uh, let's see. Are you doing high rounds on remastered maps? Yes, absolutely. I will definitely. Uh, my company, yeah, my company name is Arctic Storm Media. Um, you can go to arcticstormmedia.com if you want to learn more about that. Uh, but yes, as far as high rounds on. Um, on DLC five maps, absolutely. Origins round one hundred will definitely, uh, definitely happen, um, and even some of the other ones. Uh, Pr Prime plays. Thank you very much for subscribing. Yeah, there's a lot of uh, a lot of the DLC five uh, zombies maps. I'm definitely going to be doing some high rounds. Kino to Toten, of course. I definitely want to do a round one hundred for that. Um, all of that stuff is is definitely definitely going to be happening. Uh, what inspired you? To, what inspired you to do YouTube? Uh, we've kind of kind of addressed this already. Um, I've wanted to. I've always wanted to work for myself. And, uh, and I've, I love performing and I love uh, video and things like that. So um, so I have, uh, um, so I started a YouTube channel. I'm actually going to turn up my mic a little bit so that I can actually talk a little bit more quiet. My voice uh, is getting pretty pretty thrashed right now. So I'm going to uh, talk a little bit more quietly and turn up my microphone a little bit. Hopefully it's still at a good level for you guys. Um, a lot of people are asking about my religion. Um, and I, I, I think eventually I will do a video about this. I am, uh, the things I'll say right now, here's, here's what I'll say right now. Um, I am a Christian and I am religious. Um, and I might go into more detail later on, uh, later down the line. Uh, but for now, I mean, obviously it's a very, religion for anyone is a very personal, very private thing. Um, and so, so hopefully, hopefully, you know, hopefully that's, that makes sense to you guys. Um, Herman the German, how old are you? I'm 24. Um, Reuben last comment, King, uh, can you copy and paste? I cannot see it. Uh, will you do DLC five origins high round with me on PlayStation four? Um, again, possibly I'm possibly, I, I'm, I'm definitely gonna be doing this high rounds. Um, I don't know about high rounds with subscribers because, um, that can be pretty tricky to do and takes a very long time. Um, so we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Um, why do you look like Thor? Um, <laughs> because I have a beard and long hair. I think that's about the qualifications to look like Thor. What type of company, uh, what type can, can you type your company name in there? Cause I can't find it. What you're probably doing is you're probably misspelling Arctic, but yes, I will type in, uh, my company name. Uh, so you'll probably already see it in the chat. Arctic storm media. Um, or you can just, I'll just put the link in here as well. media.com okay um so yeah you guys can go over to that as well if you really want to know more um a lot of people misspell the word arctic which we didn't know when we started the company um but most people spell it a-r-t-i-c um no yeah they they, they miss they miss they, they leave out one of the c's in there arc because it's arctic storm media a-r-c-t-i-c most people spell it a-r-t-i-c because i think it's arctic arctic storm media but it's actually arctic 
That's how you spell like Antarctica or the Arctic. Um, anyway, um, Jacob, when are you planning to upgrade your camera? Jacob, I actually have a better camera and I actually was using it at the beginning of the stream. Um, however, it doesn't work that well uh, with my current setup. So unfortunately, uh, yeah, anyway. Um, Pamu. Um, uh, if, I mean, if you want to get into the technicality of Mormon versus Christian, uh, a lot, because you are asking, like, I did live in Utah, um, the, there's some misconceptions about the whole, like, what does the word Christian mean? Because if you want to get technical, the word Christian means somebody who believes in and follow, tries to follow the teachings of Jesus Christ. Um, and so therefore, by that definition, Mormons are Christian, even though a lot of people are confused about that. Because a lot of people think that Christian means, um, evangelical or, um, uh, what's the word? Um... Uh, Protestant. A lot of people think that Christian means Protestant. And, and, and anyway, anyway. Um, okay. So, uh, hey, what's up, Jacob? But anyway, uh, yeah, we're, we're not going to get into that now. Uh, what do you do for a living? Uh, yes, I own my own company. We've already been over that a couple of times. Are you planning to collaborate with anyone? Yes. Um, I have a lot of people that I'm working on collaborating with right now. Uh, a lot of, you know, some bigger YouTubers, some smaller YouTubers that I'm kind of got some things in the works. Uh, but it's all kind of on hold until DLC 5 actually gets released. Uh, we're kind of all doing our own things until then. And then once DLC 5 gets released, then we've got a lot of uh, collaborations in the works. So, uh, what is your favorite song? Um, right now I've been really enjoying the song, um, Say You Won't Let Go. What, who's that by? I can't even, it's, um, uh, let me, it's, um, it's a really, really good song. Uh, let me see if I can, um, it's James something. I'm sure you guys will help me out here, but, uh, James Arthur. Say You Won't Let Go by James Arthur. I've been really enjoying that song a lot. It's a very good song. Uh, let's see. Do you think DLC 5 has a high chance of being bad? Uh, I think it has a 0% chance of being bad. Uh, there's absolutely no, we already know that those are good maps. Like we've already played them. We know they're good maps. So it's like, there's just no way that it can be bad. So those maps with higher graphics just is, is there's no way it could be bad. Uh, do you know who Wolfie Raps is? Yes, I do. I've, I've watched, uh, uh watched a bit of his, his channel. I'm, I'm pretty, pretty familiar with his content. I used to watch him a lot more, uh, like about a year or two ago, uh, but not so much anymore. Uh, Hey, what's up, Tristan? Welcome to the stream. Um, Josh I was watching a video of Origins Remastered. The Ice Staff is called the Staff of Water. Yes, it is. Uh, it, is it has been renamed for whatever reason, the Staff of Water rather than the Staff of Ice. Uh, not sure why they decided to do that, but whatever. You know, whatever floats your boat, Treyarch. Uh, it's the exact same staff, does the exact same things, so not worried. Uh, Josh, I love your vids. Um, I've started YouTube and really enjoying it. Um, could you start playing Arc, uh, Arc Survival Evolved? Potentially. Um, I'm mostly a. Um, I'm mostly, I'm, I'm, you know, this channel is obviously pretty much just Call of Duty right now, and I think I'm going to keep it that way, uh, for the next, for the next little bit. Um, HF, HFHF95 says, why don't you answer me? I, um, I, I did answer your Wolfie Raps question. Um, they changed it back to the Staff of Ice, did they? Okay, I, I mean, maybe, maybe they did. Uh, what's up with your voice? I'm sick. Um, I'm sorry that I'm, I am sick. I'm going to take some, drink some more water here. Okay. Um... Have you played the Walking Dead games? Yes, I have. I have indeed played. Um, I don't. I think I've only played. Uh, I haven't played all of them, but I've played a number of them. Um, still, who knows why it was water? Yeah, I mean, I don't know. I, I don't know. I guess we'll see. Um, when it gets released, they may change it. Uh, so, I don't. Know. We don't know. We don't know. <clears throat> that was Furious Eagle. I. I. Okay. I don't know. Uh, let's see. Do you like my name? Says Rockstar has a love of watermelon. Yes, I do. Thank you very much for being here. Uh, Over dramatic guy. Welcome to the stream. Get well, Josh. Thank you very much, Rockstar. Um, what was your favorite toy? Like, my favorite toy as a, as a kid? Um, I don't know. I did have a... Uh, um, I had some some of the Toy Story sto uh, toys that I liked a lot when I was a kid that I hung on to for a while. Just be... I mean, almost for the sentimental of, like, the exact... I don't, I don't know. Yeah, I, I, I'm a big fan. I, was a, I still am a big fan of the Toy Story films. And I had, like, a Buzz Lightyear and a... Woody doll and I thought they were really cool. So, um, do over stream, do over, no, do, do overwatch live streams, please. Um, again, I'm pretty much just a call of duty guy for now. Might branch out into other games later, but for now I'm just focusing on call of duty. Can you delete some of your black ops two friends? I want to add you. Yes, Connor, I will be going in and deleting some, some Xbox 360 friends pretty soon here. Excuse me. Uh, favorite map of DLC five so far of the ones that they've revealed. Um, probably, probably moon. Um, or Origin. I mean, Origins, obviously. The thing is, Origins really doesn't look, to me, really doesn't look that different, um, which I think they've intentionally kind of done. Um, but, I mean, it, it was a Black Ops 2 map um, as opposed to, like, Black Ops 1 or World at War. So the technology is really not as old as some of the other maps. 
um, on that one. Like the graphics are much more up to date and all of that. And so there was never going to be quite as much of a shift in that one. Um, but uh, I would say Moon so far uh, looks the most different, and which I think is really, really cool. Um, Darren says, congrats on 11K. Thank you very much. More hype for Moon and Kino. Yeah, Moon and Kino. I'm, I'm more hyped for those being remastered. I think Origins Remastered is really, really cool. And I'm definitely going to be playing a lot. Uh, playing a lot of it. However, you know, it was it was Black Ops 2 as opposed to like Black Ops 1 or World at War. And so therefore, um, it's, you know, there's not that much of a, uh, a jump in technology as there is with some of the older ones. So, okay. Um, are you going are you going to stream later on Origins or Buried? I'm not going to be doing any other live streams later today. This is going to, this is going to be my only live stream for today. Um, and but but tomorrow I will be back to uh, just regular gameplay live streams and all of that jazz. Um, yeah, Kino Kino der Toten is very very cool and I'm very excited about that. Um, Chris uh, asking once again how old am I? I'm 24 years old. Um, let's see. Favorite map in all of Zombies? Uh, definitely Origins. Um, Shout out to Luke the Ga Luke the Gamer. Thank you very much for being here, my friends. All right, um, let's see. Let's let me give you guys a category for more questions here. Um, I'm trying to think of something non zombies or YouTube related. Um, ask. Um, do you like Nocter on Toten? I do. Let, yeah. Let's let's um, let's let's focus. Yeah. Let's you know keep the questions coming, my my friends. Hey, what's up, Gumby Vlog? Welcome to the stream. Um, and uh, yeah, keep keep the questions coming. Uh, you know more of. Uh, uh, less less zombies and YouTube because because um, we've answered a lot of the zombies and YouTube questions. Uh, what is your favorite map of all time? Again, Origins. Uh, favorite chips. Favorite chips flavor um, is actually I, I love Doritos. I think Doritos are really really cool um, and uh, really really cool. Uh, really good. I like them. Uh, they're 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 I like I like them a lot. Um, Apothecary servant on Noct. I don't think we'll see the Apothecary servant on Noct. Um, how do you enjoy the new house? My new house is pretty good. Uh, new house is pretty okay. This is the real Gumby vlog. Well, very cool, Gumby. Awesome to have you here. Um, let's see. What's your opinion on Nazi zombies coming back? Um, to World at War, I, th I mean, it's going to be very different, and so it's not really Nazi zombies coming back. It's it's kind of interesting because a lot of people have been like, oh my gosh, it's like we're going back to you know Nazi zombies. It's going to be just like it was in World at War, and it's actually not at all what's happening. The entirety of the Treyarch storyline has taken place in and around World War One and World War II um, between the years of 1913 and 19... I think the latest map is in 1950-something. Um, but pretty much every, everything in Call of Duty Zombies takes place in World War II um, uh, as far as Treyarch is concerned. So we're not really going back to anything. They're making a new storyline, but it's still taking place in World War II, and it sounds like it's going to be much more focused on World War II. Rather than where the Treyarch zombies got into all sorts of weird apothecary space worms, and I just like it kind of deviated from the whole original idea of World War II zombies, and it sounds like World War II is basically sort of taking it back, but making a new thing and being like we're gonna focus on the core of Nazis zombies, and that's what they're. And, and so I'm very excited for that. I think that's gonna be very cool. PlayStation 4, Xbox One. I love both my consoles equally. Um, who would who would be your next mod? I don't have plans for any moderators right this second. Nathan, have you listened to 21 Pilots yet? No, don't have social media, so I can't can't send them to you. I'm sorry, but I will try to remember. Uh, Josh, can't stay. Uh, thinking my high school. Um, I, 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 blah blah blah. You're at your high school performing with your band. Very cool. Um, do I know we have it on DVD? Uh, you have what? Uh, just warming up. Can't stay long. All right, we'll see you later. Endless. Thank you very much for being here. Do you plan on moving back to Utah? Potentially, potentially. I might move back to Utah at some point. Um, I I do enjoy. I, I like Utah. I like the weather there. Um, I like the people there. Um, but, uh, generally most of the people, um, but, um, but yeah, it's, it's, um, I don't know. I'm, I, Portland's pretty okay. Uh, very, very different. I, I apologize. My voice is really, really starting to fall apart here. Um, which is why I'm keeping the stream fairly short. Um, but Portland's pretty good, but it's not, uh, um, it's not my favorite city ever for sure. Uh, favorite call of duty, uh, black ops two. How much longer is the stream going to be? Um, just about 10 more minutes or so. Um, what places have you traveled to around the world? That is a very long list. Um, I have been to pretty much every single continent. Um, I have been to I, almost every single country in Europe. Um, I have been to Africa. I've been to Asia. I've been to the Middle East. I've been to, like I said, all over Europe. I've been to South America. I've been to most of the United States. I've been to Canada. Um, so it's, it's easier for me to tell you where I've not been. I've not been to Australia. So... <laughs> um, Let's see. Do you like sports? Um, I'm not much of a sports guy. I'm more of a video games person, and uh, and I, I I did enjoy playing basketball. I did play basketball in high school, and I was pretty okay at it. Um, I was also on a gymnastics team, um, and so so yeah. Um, have you been to Albania? I have not been to Albania. 
I want to stream. Um, you want to be about the stream to be about twenty more minutes. I don't think we're gonna go twenty more minutes. I, I did use. I did. I, I used to live in New York, actually. Uh, Sue's one. Um, favorite Mexican food. I don't know. I like pretty much all of it, actually. So, uh, have you been to Puerto Rico? I don't think I've been to Puerto Rico. Um, I may have had a layover there once. I don't remember. Um, do people ever stare at you while you're vlogging in public? Yes. People give me all sorts of weird looks while I vlog in public. Um, do you like dogs or cats? I'm more of a cat person. Um, do people, yes, yeah, but people do stare at me. Uh, who won the giveaway? I announced it over on Twitter, uh, Rigo. And so if you'd like to go over there and check that out, I already, I already messaged him and he's already accepted all that stuff. So, um, so unfortunately, uh, if, you know, if you didn't get a message from me, then it wasn't you, unfortunately. Um, how long is it taking you to grow your hair? I've been growing my hair for about four years. Uh, hey, what's up, Houston? Swell Watson? No, yeah, I, my, my, my throat sucks right now, if that's what you're referring to, but I think you're referring to working out. I do I do work out, as Houston knows, um, and uh, but I, I've been a little bit more lazy with it lately because uh, I've been so busy with streaming. Um, do you watch The Walking Dead? I watched the first couple of seasons, but I haven't watched it really since then. So, How tall are you? I am six, six feet tall. I live in Australia. Do you have any plans of coming here in the future? I would love to go to Australia. I need to I need to come up with an excuse to go to to go to Australia. Uh, somebody also asked about fan meetups. Um, I am probably going to E3 this year. Um, and so, um, if you guys are in the Los Angeles area, um, I I'll probably do a little miniature meetup at E3. Probably just outside of E3. I'll probably pick a restaurant um, or something. Find like a Chili's or something uh, just outside of E3. Um, and do a little meetup there, like a very informal meetup. Just be like, hey, at noon this time or something, um, and you know, noon on this day or whatever, I'm gonna be at the Chili's uh, for an hour or something. And so, if you guys can, uh, um, you know, if you guys want to come meet up there, that would probably be, uh, you know. So anyway, so if if you're in California in the Los Angeles area, then that that might be what we might do. Um, I, I'm probably going back to Salt Lake for Comic Con um, in in September, so I might do a little meetup there as well. Um, do you like the outdoors? I do. I do enjoy the outdoors. Hey, what's up, Dylan? Um, and uh, Jake is going to be our back. All right, we'll see. You. Do you play PlayStation 4 a lot? I do, indeed. Favorite world at war map is probably Verrucht. Whoops. Um, highest round on zombies in any map is round 100. Favorite, uh, who's the most famous person you've ever met? Uh, Brad Pitt. Um, I've actually worked with him on a film. Um, do you like One Piece anime? I do not know what that is. Um, one, yeah, is that a show or? I mean, I know what anime is, obviously, but is One Piece anime a style of it or what? Um, put a sticky note on your forehead so you can listen to Twenty One Pilots. <laughs> I'm I'm not gonna put a sticky note on my forehead. I don't even have any sticky notes. But um, my favorite my favorite YouTuber is uh, Ali A. Hey, what's up, Christian? Welcome to the stream. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh, do you want to play Black Ops Two on Xbox? Um, I I do play a lot of Black Ops Two on my Xbox One. I'm not gonna be playing any today though. Have you ever been to Michigan? Yes, I actually, uh, last year, year before last, um, I took a family vacation up there on, on the shores of Lake Michigan. Uh, we rented a house out, or like a little uh, getaway house out there uh, with some of Micah's family, um, and uh, it was cool. It was, it was a lot of fun. Uh, we, we also are going to be doing uh, another lake vacation this July, um, and, uh, uh, in, but not in Michigan, so... Um, what's, what's a movie you look forward to seeing? Um, the next Star Wars movie, definitely. Uh, you met Syndicate. He lives in Manchester near me. Very cool, man. Very, very cool. Um, you've been to Fresno. I don't think I've been to Fresno, California. I've been to a lot of places in California. Um, question and answer, or Q&A question. How are you doing? I'm doing very well, Christian. How are you? Hey, what's up, Jim Bob? Uh, favorite show? Uh, mine's Impractical Jokers. Uh, my favorite TV show right now is The 100. I've been really, really enjoying that. Richie, what's your favorite game of all time? Man, I mean, my favorites of anything is hard for me to pick. Um, I'm a huge fan of the Zelda series, obviously a huge fan of Call of Duty Zombies. Um, but picking an individual favorite out of any of that, I have no idea. I don't know. Um, let's see. Why did you start making videos and streams? Uh, Tristan, we've actually already gone over that a couple of times, so you can go back to the beginning of the stream and kind of, uh, kind of see that. How long have you been a YouTuber? Uh, Furious, I have been a YouTuber uh, for about 10 months. Um, and so... And my channel, my channel has really, really exploded in the last week. Really, uh, we've gotten over five thousand new subscribers in the last week, um, which is very, very cool. Have you watched that '70s show? I have watched a little bit of it. Uh, not so much my favorite. I actually don't really watch comedy very much. I'm actually, believe it or not, um, even though I do consider myself a pretty funny guy, um, I, I don't really watch comedy shows, and I don't really enjoy comedy movies um, or comedy TV shows. Um, 
just I don't know. There, it's just I'm I'm much more of a action movie, uh, thrillers and dramas and things that are very emotional and kind of dark. Uh, that's much more of what I prefer to watch on TV. Things like The Hundred, you know, very emotional, kind of dark, very gritty. Uh, that's what I prefer to watch on TV and uh, um, and things like that. So anyway, reacts to John Cena memes. John John Cena memes are only funny if you don't like. I've, I'm I'm assuming you mean like, um, like are you talking? Because what I'm what I'm envisioning a reacting John Cena memes is like you know where, um, for instance, I saw a uh, clip from Spider Man where you know he's like, uh, you know Mary Jane is like, wait, who are you? And he's like, you know who I am. And then he like takes a breath in and it's like John Cena. And so like that's those those things are only funny if you don't know that it's coming. So reacting specifically going and reacting to John Cena memes. Probably wouldn't be that funny because you like you know it's coming if that makes any sense. And comedy tip here: this is something I learned a long time ago. Things that are unexpected are funnier. Um, and so anyway, um, HF, I'm not intentionally skipping any of your comments. Um, let's see, I have been here since 200 subs. Yeah, Gumby, you have yeah yeah it's Gumby, you've been here for a very long time, 160 somewhere over like that. What's your opinion on AMC's The Walking Dead? Um, I, I watched the first couple seasons, haven't kept up with it since because um, it it got a little too almost like soap opera esque for me. Um, and, uh, so, I mean, it does seem like it's kind of the show that I'd be into, but it's, I don't know. It's, um, uh, it, it got, it got a little, got a little too much for me actually in a bit. Um, have you ever played, have you ever been to Alcatraz Island? I've not actually been to Alcatraz Island actually. Um, it's someplace I'd like to go eventually. It seems like it'd be pretty cool, especially, you know, with mom of the dead. Um, uh, Peter Alex says I've been here since four subscribers. I don't think so, my friend, but, uh, but you have been here a while. So thank you. Um, are you playing tomorrow? Yes, guys, I will be doing a regular uh, vlog, uh, not vlog, excuse me, a regular gameplay video tomorrow, regular live stream, it'll all be great. Um, have you watched Guardians of the Galaxy 2? I have not watched Gu Guardians of the Galaxy 2 as of yet. Do a gaming setup video, I actually already have one, it is down in my description, you can go check it out. Um, favorite kids show? Um, I really haven't, I, I, I don't really have a favorite kids show um, because I, I didn't watch TV when I was a kid. Uh, we just had movies. Uh, we didn't have like cable TV when I was growing up, um, and so HF, you're I'm not skipping anything. You haven't said anything since the last time you said something. Um, do you want to make a buried train route video? Um, I've, I've I've talked about my buried train route a number of times um, on 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 stream, um, but I I mean I suppose if you guys want that I could uh, uh, do that. So play some buried tomorrow. I might play some buried tomorrow actually. Um, is YouTube your main job? So right now. Um, I am treating YouTube as a full-time job. I'm treating, I'm, I'm, I work eight hours a day on YouTube, uh, most days. Um, I do have other things like that. Uh, other, 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 I have other sources of income besides YouTube though, um, outside of that. So play Mob of the Dead. I might indeed, yes, play some Mob of the Dead as well. I'm not, I'm not, not 100% sure what I'm streaming tomorrow, but it should be fun. Um, no, I said, do you want me to, oh, Sooth, I, I don't know, my friend. Uh, oh, oh. Um, I mean, yeah, I mean, you're welcome to make me make one of them. Um, I have some pretty good uh, roots that I know as well already. What do you think of my project that I made for you? Uh, Berserker, I believe, were you the one that uh, drew the logo? Because that was very cool. That was very, very cool. Um, search up a, a picture of Pilot 21 on Google. Not not right now. Not right now, uh, Nathan. Um, uh, the Wolf Warrior says, please. Wait, I... <laughs> welcome, Wolf Warrior. How old are you? Yep, I'm, I'm 24 years old, as as I've said a couple of times. How would I collab with you? I've tried contacting you on Twitter. Um, yes, so I don't do a ton of on-stream collaborations, just to be frank. Uh, my time is very limited, and um, my collaboration streams, frankly, don't really do as well as far as views go. Um, and so it's I, I, I'm getting to a point where I, I, I hate to say it, but um, I, don't, I, I don't really plan on doing collaborations with small channels uh, for right now. Um, and so I don't want to be dashing anybody's dreams or anything like that. But, um, you know, I, but there, there comes a point where, um, if I was to just be like, Hey, you know, random viewer who's got, you know, a thousand subscribers or something at a very small channel, I'm going to collab with you. Um, it could potentially actually be kind of damaging to my channel, uh, because that the content, just to be frank, the content's not going to be as high quality because my commentary is not going to be as as smooth, um, and and our back and forth won't be as rehearsed and as not rehearsed, but like it won't be as smooth because you know we don't we haven't ever worked together before because it takes time for you know two content creators to kind of work together really smoothly, um, and so doing a one off collaboration with a smaller YouTuber um, would actually be kind of damaging to my channel at this point. So 
Does that, does that make any sense? So I mean, it's not not impossible for me to collab with smaller channels. I have I have I have done collaborations with channels that are much smaller than me. Um, so you know, send me your channel a uh, number of times, you know, and if, if I don't happen, if I don't see it, then just send, keep sending it to me until I do. So, um, can you check out Nebulous? I'll friend you. And uh, if, if you just tell me your username, what? <laughs> I don't, I don't know that I have a, a, I don't know what you're talking about. Um, who else? Um, that's racist. If you don't collab with smaller channels, it can't be racist because I'm not, they're not small channels is not a race. Racist. It means that you are prejudiced against a certain race. Um, uh, you know, unkind, potentially, potentially it could be seen that way. Um, but it's just kind of, um, it's, it's just kind of, I'm, I'm at a point with my channel where I can be much more selective with who I collaborate with. And I've always just on, on stream collaborations. You guys know, I don't really do streaming collaborations, period. Um, I, I've been contacted by YouTubers that are even larger than me who've asked for collaborations with me. And I've, I've said no, because, because I, I, I'm not really a, an on stream collaboration kind of guy. Just collaboration streams are really awkward uh, because we're both trying to talk with our chat. We're both trying to keep up commentary. And so it just tends to be really, really awkward. So anyway, so just, I, I just, I really don't do on stream collaborations uh, hardly at all. So, um, uh, 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 yes, I don't know how to pronounce your name. Govani something, something Govani. Thank you uh, for being here. I do remember you. Um, let's see. Um, let's see. Settle in because I'm about to tell you the story of my life, specifically why it ended. All right, sounds good, Gumby. I <laughs> uh, hope you remember me. Hope I hope you remember me. Can't even talk. I hope you remember me when you become a, a big, and I want you to remember that I am your fan. I was your fan when you were at 10k. Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah, I've I've told you guys a number this a number of times before. If you're staying active in my chat, if you're staying active with me on Twitter, um, you know, then there's no reason I'm ever really gonna forget you. I have a very good memory. And so as long as you're staying active, um, I will definitely, I'll definitely remember you. Um, Dalek rated you, rated you, uh, was it you? No, um, Dalek didn't raid me, um, but Dalek did come to my chat. Um, Dalek and Chucky both were in my chat for a bit. So, um, let's see. Have you ever trolled people in a public match? Um, I kind of sort of tried to a couple of times, but I am not very good at trolling to be frank. So, um, anyway. Um, goal of 2017. I've, I've talked about some of the goals that I have already. Uh, probably won't, probably won't read this while well, I am, but what's your advice for growing my YouTube channel? Because people don't really like me at my school and I want to have a lot of subscribers so people won't ignore me. Um, there's a number of different levels to that, that, um, that comment there. Uh, first of all, um, if you're having trouble with people not liking you at school, I'm not sure YouTube is the fastest or the most efficient route to fixing that problem. I think there's a lot of better ways to go about that. Um, however, as far as growing your channel, Absolutely. I'm actually going to be doing, um, I hopefully will have this video ready by Sunday. Um, I'm going to have a video going out on Sunday that's going to be um, a, a video talking about how to grow your small YouTube channel um, and doing some some different uh, tips on that and that sort of thing. So anyway, um, unfortunately, guys, we are out of time. I actually went a few minutes late anyway. Um, I do have other things I have to get done tonight. And so thank you all very, very much for being here. If you guys have further questions, you guys are welcome to hit me up on Twitter. This could become a regular thing on my channel. I might start doing this on a weekly basis. Uh, meme, meme scoped. Thank you very much for subscribing. Um, I might might be a regular thing on my channel. I'm not sure they'll always be live, but if you guys do have, you can actually use um, hashtag Ask Josh if you do have other Q and A questions for me. And uh, basically, uh, I'll start you know screenshotting those and, and taking note of those, and then I will. Uh, um, and you know, basically when I feel like I have enough of them, I'll, then I'll do another Q and A. So if you guys do have questions for me, like I said, tweet them to me. Um, you can at me or just use hashtag ask Josh. Thank you all so much for being here. You guys are awesome. I'm the Josh Watson. I'll see you guys all in the next one.